everybody, Jackie here. Guess what we're gonna be doing? You got it. We're gonna be doing some tiles and making them into coasters. Yes, very exciting stuff. You gotta love cake spinner. You gotta love painting with a cake spinner. Yeah? Hello everybody, <laughs> hello everybody. All right, well, guess what? We're getting straight into it. I have got, uh, well, first of all, I've got a shower cap on the spinner so that it doesn't get dirty. Can you see the shower cap? Yeah, there you go. Beautiful shower cap under there. Just pull that off every time you finished doing a set of coasters. All right, here comes the house paint. This is, what I've got there, is a mixture of good old house paint. I'll get it out and show you the can so you know exactly what I'm talking about. It's Torbman's Sunproof. And the color is white. There's all the information you need. That's from Bunnings. This is in Australia, so I don't know what you can get in America and the UK. Probably something like just, just an outdoor house paint that's UV protected um, and it's white, so don't get any color put in it. Okay, and that's mixed with some GAC 800 or GAC 800 from Golden. Okay, so you put uh, about a quarter of this compared to the outdoor paint. Um, or not even a quarter really, it's just to stop it cracking, just to stop this paint cracking. All right, first color I'm going to use is a Boom, Boom Gel. And the color is a, like a navy blue. I can't tell you what the color is, I don't think, because it's something blue. They have all these funny names. Um, yes, but look at look at all the paint on, on there. I can't tell you what color it is, sorry. Okay, followed by Pebio Studio Acrylics. And this is um, a iridescent green blue. There you go, got that colour for you. You don't need much colour. And then we're going to do the 24 karat gold by Deco Art Metallics. Everyone knows that colour, it is a winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. And we've got another boom gel here and once again the colour has no, I can't even peel it off. It is, ah, it's a, it's a light blue, pale blue. Okay, I'm just gonna tilt it over a bit to center it before I put the miracle paint on. Now this is a mixture um, of um, Amsterdam Titanium White mixed with Floetrol and I've mixed it about uh, I reckon about six to one because I do more than what everybody says more of the Floetrol because it gets more of the, the webbing the lacing so a bit of that and then we blow with our mouth. Okay. 
Alrighty. What can you see there? I might just come in a bit closer. So that's what we've got so far. All right. And then you, you just let it sit for a bit before you spin it. My hair's looking pretty good today. If I don't say so myself. I washed it. <laughs> spin! Spin, baby, spin. Is there a song with that in it? With spin in it? Spin. Spin doctors. Spin. Not that I can think of, and that's why I'm not singing. I'll have to put some music on or something for you. Because I can't think of a song to sing. I love singing. Okay, what do we got going on here? We've got a bit of white in the corners. We've got a bit of blue, a bit of light blue, a bit of dark blue, a bit of the iridescent green. One more spin. One more spin. Get some of that white off. And then we're going to use this to scoop it off. Oh yeah, that got that the white corners off. That's good. All right, perfect. So we'll scoop it off over here. Oops, lost your baby. Okay, get back on. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. Bring it up to you for a bit of a look. How good's that? I mean, that is. It's excellent, isn't it? I mean, I don't want to brag, but I'm pretty good at doing these. And I, I've never done the Shelly art course or anything like that. I'm just good at doing them. I think it's because I've got the, the Australian flow troll. Like you can't go wrong if you've got the Australian one. So here we go again. I'm making eight of these, but I'll probably just show you to make it a short little video. So that is the paint that I got out before. <laughs> I'll say it again. It's the, if you can go into your Home Depot um, place, like ours is Bunnings, I don't know what yours is called, and just get an outdoor paint, UV protectant, and get white. Don't get them to put any color in it, just get the already white, white on the label. And then mix it with your GAC 800, about a quarter of that in, just to stop any you know, cracking or splitting, you know, just to give it a nice smooth finish. Um, look, you, as I said, you probably don't even need a quarter, but you know, that's the maximum. You could go down to about an eighth, I reckon. Um, and then like the more you put in, the um, runnier it is. So you wouldn't want it any runnier than what I've got it today. And I probably put in um, a quarter. Oh, I put a lot in. I put a quarter in of the GAC 800 and it's, it's very runny. You wouldn't want it any runnier than that. Okay, let's go with the colors again. So I wish I had these. Maybe if I take my glove, glove off, I can scratch the white paint off to get the exact name. Let's see how I go. Yes, looking good. Cassowary, is it? Funny names. Yep, Cassowary Blue. Okay. I'll just try and scratch the other one off while we're at it. And this is a blue as well. What funny name will this have? It's going to be fairy, 
Fairy Wren. I think that's a bird. Fairy Wren Blue. That's the lighter one. Okay. Great. Put my glove back on. Here we go. Now we've got all the names. So we've got Boom Gel Cassowary Blue to start. And I was pretty happy with that first one. So I'm going to do the colours in the same order. Actually, I'm just going to check the sample that I was trying to match. Uh, probably, yeah, I've done pretty good because it's a bit less gold, which is what she wanted. So that's perfect. Perfect. All right. So that and then... Which order did we do it in? We did this one next, which is the um, Pebio Studio Acrylics in iridescent blue green. Maybe a touch more of that because that didn't come up a lot. And then the 24 karat gold. Oh, it's got a lid on it. <laughs> From Deco Art metallics and just that little bit and that's um, gonna be the perfect amount of gold and then we've got the boom gel fairy wren blue what a funny name so it's pale blue basically and that's because I'm putting that color on last it is the color that comes out the most I'll just center that up a little bit. Yeah. And then I'm going to put on our um, catalyst. What do we call it? Um, I don't know. Anyway, it's um, Amsterdam. Is it titanium white? Amsterdam. Yeah. Amsterdam titanium white mixed with. Australian Floetrol and yes, I, I put a lot of Floetrol in there because I love getting all those, um, all that webbing. It just looks so good on coasters. All right, about that much. And then we blow it. without getting it in your hair that's just been washed. All right, and then we sit it down, let it rest. Oh, head spin. Head spin. Ooh, ooh. Ouch. Okay, that's enough. Spin it. I don't wait very long. I don't have a lot of patience. You've probably worked that out already. <laughs> Doesn't take much to work it out. It's a bit, it's on a slope, isn't it? Because it's all shooting off the same direction. What if I put it over here a bit? Come on, what's happening? I want to get that white off. Hmm. So it's all good except a bit too much white in that corner. So Let's try another spin. We'll just keep spinning till, till that white comes off. Well, we don't want the tile to show through either. So whichever comes first, let's have a look. Is the tile going to show if we do one more spin? I don't think so. I hold my hands up <laughs> so that they don't, even though I've got gloves on, if I put them down there, they're going to get paint all over them. 
and then that's why the paint goes on the bottles and then the bottles are dirty all right what are we gonna do here i think i'm gonna do one more spin just got a tiny bit of white what was the other one? Oh, the other one's got a bit of white on it. Okay, I'm going to take it off. Oh! Got stuck. Okay. Because I want to, I don't want all the, you know, lines to get ruined. See over here, like if I did any more spins, that beautiful dark blue would come off. see the dark blue um, on this side here on this side if I had a spun anymore I'd have none of that left got a good shot of that how good is the webbing the white webbing <laughs> and um, it sort of turns a different color when it when it dries so it turns into, I'm just stacking them on plastic cups, by the way. I'll, I'll put the camera down and show you. Oh, I've got paint all over my hand though. I'll take that glove off for a second. So down here, I'm just stacking them on plastic cups, all right, until they dry. And then they go over onto my table. Um, once they're dry, I take them over onto my table and I spray them with the Squirts Gloss, two coats. Um, and so then they're nice and shiny on the front, like this one. This was the sample I was doing that I wanted it to be similar to. And I've done a pretty good job. They wanted, well, I wanted a bit less gold. So these are really nice. So these have had their coats of the squirts varnish already. So they're nice and shiny. And then on the back, they'll get a cork um, adhesive square. And that'll look really good. And then it'll have my stamp business stamp on it um i haven't even got one here as a sample i can show you because so i'm waiting for all the cork to come in from china apparently it's been delayed again so um it might be a while unfortunately i've got so many coasters waiting for people who have bought them just waiting for those cork backs um so fingers crossed they come soon and when they do I'll do a short little video uh, I've already done a video of the squirts um, gloss going on but I'll do a little video of the adhesive backings and this business stamp going on um, you know it'll only be like two or three minutes but people like to see stuff all right I probably should have pressed the end before I put my gloves back on uh, this thumb, no, this pinky is going to turn it off because there's not much paint on there. Okay. <laughs> so, um, I hope you enjoyed that video. I don't like that. I do that high pitched voice like, hi everybody. And then when I play it back, I go, oh, why do I use that voice? Why can't I just use my normal voice, which is sort of like this I guess um, hi guys how you going that's my is that my normal voice I don't know y you try and do your normal voice it's kind of hard to do when you're under pressure uh, anyway my high pitch voice my normal voice whichever one I use thank you for coming and watching and please subscribe oh i'd love more subscribers i'm really trying so hard to get subscribers and i've only got i've only got 30. it's so embarrassing all right so hopefully i get a few more subscribers 
for these videos to be watched. All right, thanks guys. Bye, Pinky, bye.